The probability of A is proportional to the surface of this circle. Also consider event B, which has the same probability. P A and P B overlap, meaning that A and B can occur simultaneously, and the probability of this event is the intersection of these two circles. The conditional probability reads what is the chance of B occurring given that A happens. Visually, we see that the part of PB that falls within PA is exactly their intersection, the yellow part. Doing the same for PA given B, and looking at the resulting fractions, we see that since PA and PB are equal, these conditional probabilities are also equal. When PA and PB are not equal, however, this is not the case, but visually we can immediately see why. The conditional probability is the relative size of the intersection compared to PA or PB. We see that the yellow region is much larger compared to PA than it is to PB, due to their relative size difference. Therefore, the same holds for the corresponding conditional probabilities. 